All right, Joe Fazer. Joe Fazer is a popular fitness YouTuber that I've personally been watching for over a year now. However, his channel is very focused on the fact that his physique is quote unquote natural. What I'm going to show in this video today is genuine proof that he is not natural. And this is a problem because Joe is one of those YouTubers getting hundreds of thousands of views selling this idea to his fans that they can achieve a look like him in a very short amount of time naturally. All right, so I'm just gonna get right into it. We're gonna be taking a look at his body transformation video here. And after analyzing the video, we're gonna actually be taking a look at some medical Harvard studies that essentially debunk the possibility that he could achieve this look naturally in the amount of time that he's advertising. All right, so he was always a skinny kid. All right, and right here. I want us to pause for a second, take mental note as to where his physique is at this current time. It's clear to me from this video that he's putting in a lot of hard work. He's doing his own research, he's changing his diet, he's changing his form up a little bit. His physique has changed drastically. It's insane. All right, so similar shot to the one that we looked at earlier. It's from the back. And let's just compare the two images side by side. They are very, very different. And keep in mind that this is one year. All right, so I think now it's time to get into the science of this all. As some of you may already know, there are three body types. We have the ectomorph, the mesomorph, and the endomorph. Essentially, each body type has its own pros and cons. However, in Joe Fazer's case, he most certainly takes after the ectomorph body type. So let's read right here. Ectomorphs have a difficult time putting on muscle mass because their metabolism has a tendency to run higher than other body types. In the fitness terms, they are often called hard gainers for this very reason. Joe Fazer has one of the most difficult body types to put muscle mass on, and yet his natural one-year body transformation is absolutely insane. It's becoming more and more obvious now at this point in the video that his body transformation is not natural. You don't just naturally put on this much muscle mass and look this good. And to prove it, I'm going to simply use Google because that's how I passed high school. absolutely cannot build muscle without exercise. Now, I don't really know what else you guys want from me, but I think the research here pretty evidently shows that you don't just magically start gaining muscle. Uh, but anyway, uh, uh, back to the video. It's clear to me that Joe Fazer put in a lot of hard work, dedication, time, discipline, most likely many, many hours of his day-to-day -day life in the gym in order to build a physique like this. You don't just sit around and somehow naturally start looking like this. This is something that you have to work on. And Joe, what I really think that you should do is be honest with your viewers. You need to let them understand that they can't just naturally look this good. They've got to put in the hard work, they've got to put in the time, and they've got to be consistent in the gym and with their diet. All right, so one last thing. We're going to be taking a look at Joe's most recent video where he is confronting bodybuilders, uh, asking them whether or not they are natural. So after being asked whether or not they are natural, these were the responses. I like the feeling of standing out. I like the feeling of walking to a room, the presence that yeah. I kind of give. Uh, I wanted to compete. Um, I was badly bullied when I was younger. I was really skinny growing up, so it was so hard to put on muscle. And I just wanted that edge. And at the end of the day, I'm not doing it to compete. I'm not doing it that. I'm doing it for myself. To so make myself feel better on myself. These are very valid reasons for wanting to not be natural. They took it upon themselves to work very, very hard in the gym in order to get a better physique. They didn't just sit around and expect to get as large as they were. They put in the hard work, they put in the dedication just like Joe did. And I know that's controversial, but yes, Joe is not natural in that sense. All right, everybody, so in conclusion, I know this video is controversial. I know everyone watching this video is going to have a lot to say. I know many, many will disagree. However, ultimately, Joe Fazer is not natural. He did not just sit around and somehow magically grow into his body. All right, anyway, that's it for today's video. Make sure to stay tuned for next week's video where I Google the definition of natural bodybuilding before making this video.